Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the David's Cookies brand. These are uh, cake slices. So we have a rainbow cake and a chocolate overload cake. Um, and I wanted to open them uh, for you up close just so you could see how they come. Because when we try them over at the table, I'm going to move them on this plate. Uh, but this is the rainbow cake. Let's see. There we go. It came open pretty easy. And then this, the only thing I did was I sliced the uh, ingredients because I had to take a picture. Ah, this one, the lid came off. Oh, okay. The, the sticker kept that one on. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take my spatula. And these have been, uh, we bought them for $3.99 each at Meyer. And when you buy them at Meyer, they are in the refrigerated section of the uh, deli. And so I have had them in the refrigerator uh, since we got back home the as bakery. well. I mean, in the bakery. <laughs> the not bakery. the deli. Go buy not them the, the deli. deli. <laughs> the bakery. Sorry, the bakery. Um, and I've had them in the refrigerator as well. So that is how they look out of the package. So we're going to try the rainbow slice first. And like I said, these were three ninety nine dollars each in uh, the bakery at Meyer. Uh, rainbow cake. It says these are made, uh, manufactured by David's Cookies in Fairfield, New Jersey. It's davidscookies.com. One slice is, wow, 800 calories. 800 calories. That's probably how much you always eat when you eat slices of cake. <laughs> yeah, but normally my, ba my bakery cakes are bigger than that, my slices. Mm -hmm. um, a thousand calories. Wow, 800 calories. Okay, that's just amazing to me. And it doesn't give any other description. I'm assuming it's not some of the frosting came over the top, didn't it? Um, it doesn't say, it just says the one, number one ingredient is cake mix. <laughs> I want to taste the ice. That's what I got. You sound that, like you're crunching yours. Those mm -hmm. have like sparkles in the back. Oh, okay. Um, that white frosting, whatever, if that's what they're calling frosting, has almost no flavor it's like cool whatsoever. Oil. Yeah, it is not, um, it's like a hardened Cool Whip, cool whip. Yeah, yes. Literally. It is not, um, it's not super sweet. sweet. No, yeah. it's not sweet. It, um, and there are no instructions on these. Like I said, they've only been in the refrigerator. There's no instructions on these packages that say to lay them out for an hour, 15 minutes, whatever. I don't think they would need it anyway. Mm -mm. I, I, I don't either. I, I believe you need any cake straight from the refrigerator. That, it's pretty plain. It, it's just the plainest. There's absolutely no flavor. There, the I don't think, even though I ate a piece with just red, I get a little bit of the dye, and I got a little bit of the dye from the, the green and the purple. Yeah, yeah. I did too. Um, it's not super bad, but you do get a little. You bit. do get. I'm left with that Just flavor, a little bitter. but there's no sweetness in it at all. No, there's no vanilla. There's no anything really. No. I, would, I wouldn't get that one at least. Absolutely not. I think you're going to be so disappointed. I think, um, like for me, when I go over to that department, my eyes get really big because there's all these beautiful cakes, and um, we bought a, a rainbow cake like this from Kroger, and. I thought it was really going to be delicious. We bought two. We bought a rainbow and then we bought like a pastel one. And it was the pastel one that ended up being the really good one and not the rainbow. I would not buy that. Mm, no. it, it's just not good. No, like I said, it's not even a good vanilla cake. I mean, no. it's just nothing. This is the chocolate overload cake. Take a on the top. And it is, it's 850 calories. Can you imagine wasting 800, uh, 800 calories on that? No. On nothing. So this is 850 calories. And the number one ingredient in this one is heavy cream, which is interesting. That is a very um, moist cake. Mm -hmm. Let me try that. That's why, that's a, that's a lot. Um, 
for it to be 850 calories, I don't know what the calories are in. It must be in the milk or something because there's no sugar in those at all. <laughs> there's no there's no sweetness there. I think the frosting had some. Yeah, yeah I had a big hunk. Why? Well, I had a, not a small hunk. I had a big hunk of frosting. I do think the frosting has some sweetness. The cake itself does. It's it's a moist cake. I do have to say that, but it mm. um, it it's not worth eight hundred fifty calories. No. At all. I would, um, I would, any box cake out there, mm -hmm. any brand, a box cake would put these to shame. Yeah, I really, really. Yeah, these are nothing. Absolutely nothing. This, what this was, was a waste of $8. Yeah, it for really was. For two slices of cake. The, the rainbow one literally has hardly any flavor at all. The chocolate one does have a little bit of chocolate flavor, but it's more of a baking cocoa kind of flavor. Um, and there's no sweetness to it. Um, you would expect for that big of a slice of cake and that many calories, it would be super sweet, like a, like a box cake mix mm -hmm. would be with frosting. It's just not. People will do what we did. They'll buy them one time and then never buy them again. Just like, well, or those- return them. Those at Kroger, <laughs> those at Kroger uh, we've, ne we've never bought them again. I yeah. mean, everything that I buy, it seems like I'm disappointed from the, from the bakery. So it's like, why not make your own? You know, uh, there's there's very very few things that actually are worth getting, at least from the refrigerated part. Yeah. You know. Well, these look really nice, but they didn't live up taste wise. Not at all. No, these uh, no. If I was to rate these on a scale of one to five, five being the best. This would be one because I'd give they them a one. Them. Yeah. Because you can actually eat them. And I'd, they give would, them I'd give them a they one. They would fill you up and give you calories for your day. That's about all it would do yeah. for you. <laughs> so I don't hate them. I don't like dislike them enough for them like, like they're horrible. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't put them in my hate pal at the end of the month. But I would never recommend anybody about this. No, because there's just nothing to them. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.